Anyway, Will, would you like to talk for a sec so I can find the next song? Well, yes, I, I, I'll just say that News from the Sun, the, the, the art show in, in all the galleries, was, was also part of the Phonicon. And I, I thought that was, that was really good. And um, I, I think there could, there could have been more from that as well. But maybe we can explore it over, over the next few, few weeks. Um, just looking at how the themes from the rest of the show connect, connected in with it. I'm still uncertain about it. Um, I'm trying to find the, the, the description in the Phoenix Gallery. Um, in the, sorry, in the Phoenix uh, Guide. Um, and it's something like referencing the physical structures of communication technology such as satellite dishes. And they're saying that each of the artists display an interest in subverted or obsolete modernity, referencing technology, architecture and design that offers optimistic promises of a utopian future. So I'm not quite sure what the, what the intention of the show really is. Is it, is it trying to say um, that none of these utopian visions have come about? Is it a critique of modernity or is it um, pointing the way? I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm really not quite sure, but I, I also know that on, on Friday, that's tomorrow, there's um, a TED in Exeter, which is technology, entertainment and design. So presumably that has got a, a connection with science and art and uh, what would the other one be? What did, yeah, it would be art and design, science and technology, uh, entertainment and art, art again. Something like that. I, I, I'm hoping uh, some of the people at, at Ted Exeter will have seen News from the Sun and um, may have a view on where technology is going. Because, uh, Chris, shall I carry on for a bit? Or have you got um, music ready? I have a piece of music. I'm not sure what it is, but... Let's play it and see what happens. Okay, here it is in a sec. Yep. <laughs> 